Hello, party people. Are you excited? We're at the Dollar Tree. We're gonna browse all the back to school stuff. I recently went to Target and did the back to school dollar spot section. So exciting. So maybe you'll find this exciting too. Let's find out what they have. Yes, 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 they do have a bunch of stuff out. But mostly to my left here, I see these Nutella packets. Are you kidding me? Initially, I came here thinking, oh, I'm not gonna buy that much. Um, I already see like 20 things I want. <laughs> Notebooks and binders and cute pencil pouches, index dividers. Uh, what else? I don't know how to finish the song. <laughs> how else can I show my excitement other than singing? Oh my gosh, okay, I'm kind of freaking out. I guess I should just pick somewhere to start and dive into this stuff, yeah? All these really cute back to school like hair accessories. I've been trying to reach that one way at the very top, that white one. I can reach it, but I can't seem to pull it off the hook. I'm not even that short, I'm like 5'5", five five, so let's get started. These double-sided markers right here. Oh, it's a three pack and then a two pack. Why did they do that? Uh, I guess they're scented, pretty cool. And then here's like a jumbo poster marker. Okay, if you need one. Here are some pouches and it's a two pack. So they're little pencil pouches. It's like a, like a waterproof material, but two for a dollar. I feel like that's a good price. And look at these cute prints. You make it rain rainbow. <laughs> My sweet little Eleanor would like that. And then they have these three pack of markers with a cute print on them. And these lunchbox note. Lunchbox? Lunchbox. Yes, look how sweet this is. Not only the box, like you can re-gift something in here. Maybe even if it's just like a gift card or whatever, but turn it around and it has what kind of notes. There's only 18 notes in here, but for a dollar, come on, that's awesome. They're already pre-printed, and then I guess it's half and half. You get some that you can write in yourself. I love this. Some notebooks right here. They're blank inside. I'll peek, because they're not lined. It's just a blank notebook. So ideas, notes, and they have a green one with sunglasses, cute. I also found a pencil. Moving down here, I have seen a ton of really cute notebooks. So I'll sift through these so I can show you a couple. These are lined notebooks. Good for just obviously jotting down notes, hence the title. Uh, over here, bigger notebooks. Looks like they're a similar prints. Oh, they also have composition books for a dollar. Oh my word. Oh, and it looks like they have very similar prints on them. Did I already say that? I feel like I did. So they have spiral comp and then little baby ones. Oh, and there's more down here. With all the fun food that kids love to eat. I like this one, life is sweet for our sugar fiends like me. They also sell one inch binders, which I didn't know they sold at the Dollar Tree, but apparently they do. I don't know how much they are elsewhere. I'll have to compare later. Uh, looks like they have pencils and I've actually seen a variety of pencil colors, but be careful because the quality of pencils that you'll find at the Dollar Tree they're harder to sharpen. Oh, a jumbo tweezer? Is this a school supply now? <laughs> a foam dry erase block. That would be fun for all kinds of games. Oh, an inflatable globe. That's really cool. It's very loud in here. <laughs> a sand timer, some chalk, multicolored and white. Okay, I waited for it to die down a little bit. I'm right by the register, so that might have something to do with it. We saw these at Target, also for a dollar, but they have different colors here at the Dollar Tree. It fits a full-size sheet of paper, which I think is fantastic. You can put anything in there. This is a magnetic pocket with window, and they have a bunch of colors in here too, but you only get one for a dollar. I should clarify that. Ooh, a dry erase paddle. Ooh, this would be fun for games and stuff, even sight words. Okay, I like that. Over the chair organization, I love these. Oh my word, and they have uh, pink, purple, green, that's all I see. But for a dollar, oh my gosh, you cannot beat the price of these, and it's so functional. If I could stop shaking, there it is. 
this dry erase practice board is so practical. It says it's two-sided, but the other side is just blank, so. <laughs> I mean, there's that. Uh, they have a novelty ball. That's pretty cool. Study your countries on here. Okay. Uh, over here, they have some test tubes, which I think is really adorable. We, would be fun for some science projects. And then they have a bunch of different workbooks. So test prep workbook, uh, grades one through two activity workbook, uh, phonics and reading. We got some of these last summer and we went through them. They're very small books, but it keeps the kids busy, you know? Oh, subtraction. Okay, let's move to the wall of oh, supplies. I'm real excited about this wall. First of all, there's a ton of highlighters. You see that? It's like an eight pack of highlighters. And they have colored, they also have permanent markers, a whole pack of them, and then black ones right there. Single Sharpies, yes. Sharpie name brand for a dollar. And then they have dry erase markers right there. Bic, oh, look at that. Look at all these name brands that I'm finding. They're at the D2. Okay, what else? Oh my gosh, Expo. Stop it right now. A dollar, guys, a 64 pack of crayons for a dollar. Here's the real question. Does it have the sharpener on the back? Oh yes, it does. You better believe it. <laughs> Making my way downtown, I see some student planners. They're real heavy, so I just put them down. They kept falling, but I pulled some out. These are the different prints. So adorable, am I right? So let's peek inside one of these. So it lays out the month for you. Oh, does it just do the month? Oh, looks like it, but you know what? Sometimes that's all you need. You know, this is nice and thin. You can throw this in your backpack. It won't take up too much space or your purse. You know what I mean? I see a few more uh, different kind of student planners down here, different prints and very cute. So these are a bit thicker. They're spiral notebooks. So let's peek inside here. I assume this one has the month laid out and then the individual days as well, which would make sense. And this is perfect. Perfect little planner. My high school used to give out uh, planners for free. Do high schools still do that? I don't know, but they weren't this cute. I will say that. They also have this smaller planner option in multiple colors, pink, purple, blue, and black. And um, it, it's not a spiral. It's a little bit more, I don't want to say flimsy because that gives off the impression that it's cheap and it's not. It's just very inexpensive. Obviously it's a dollar, but here's a peek inside. It's perfect. If this is all you need, like, the same thing at Target would go for eight bucks. You know what I mean? I know because I have one. <laughs> okay, the store has finally died down a little bit. It's not so loud. They have glitter markers. I think these are just fantastic. They have an assortment of colors, not too many, but enough. And then I totally scanned over these. They have stamp markers. These would be so fun for kiddos. And, oh my gosh, scented, scented markers and if you can see up there, circles, stamp circle markers. I'm really impressed with the variety that they have, especially with the pens. Look how many pens you get for a dollar and the colored pens. I did a little shopping while it was super loud in here and my kids want colored pens and I found this four pack and this eight pack and then I came to this wall and found this huge eight pack. So they definitely for back to school have a lot more options. And they have a whole pack of red right there. If you're a teacher, hello, right there for you. Oh my goodness, and then look at these. Two, I think Zebra is a brand name, yeah? I know Pentel <laughs> is quick drying ink. They have a couple colors, red, blue. Shut your face, Dollar Tree. Are you kidding me? They have these Terraconda pencils. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. I haven't slowed down long enough to actually use my brain and read the word, but you get a four pack in here for a dollar. These, I've heard, are the number one best pencil. Compared to these, like yes, a pencil is a pencil, but they don't sharpen the same way. I know from experience, before I bought a like an electronic pencil sharpener, I sat there and did them all by hand. My hand was cramping up after like two Dollar Tree pencils. Okay, I'm not even kidding. Anyway, they have, what the heck is this? Oh my gosh, a stylus pen, that is hilarious. I love that. And then they have mechanical pencils right there. Some more, there's a zebra brand. These are really elegant too, look at that. And they sell extra lead. 
Wow, okay, I'm slowing down. I'm making my way downtown, but I need to go uptown, you know what I mean? A bunch of pencils, they have Bic and, you know, just different prints if you're into that. They're really, really cute. And they have those pencil, cushy things, rippies, if you're into that, if you need it. Okay, over here, I kind of passed this up. This is pretty cool. They have a calendar in here and it's like laminate on the outside so you can protect it a little bit. And it says it's a full year calendar so they should have 12 sheets in there. <gasps> clipboards, yay! So they have just plain black clipboards if you're into that. Or they have the fun ones. Okay, tell me this isn't so pretty. And for a dollar, how can you beat that price? Couple different prints. Oh, love it. Um amazing but first coffee here's another great print like stained glass what else have you got for me dollar tree looks like a little chalkboard double-sided this would be great for home learning and they also have oh a dry erase board this is really nice it's again super thin looks like they have two prints the blue down here and this fun one. Oh my goodness it's a book cover but you can cover multiple books with it. I love that. Do people still cover their books? Is that a thing? We used to decorate ours. And then they have um, like a thicker dry erase board. And this one comes with a marker for a dollar. Okay, making my way up, they have a few organizational items right here. Desk organization, you can put, I don't know, possibilities are endless, paper clips, whatever, in there, pencils, but these are really cute colors, blue, purple, pink, and green. And then of course, black. I think they have this all the time, the black one. And I spy Elmer's glue. It's not as big as the Dollar Tree brand, but again, it's name brand. But I think back to school season, you can find these for like 50 cents at, you know, a normal store. So I'm gonna hold off on the glue. Great time to stock up though if your kids like to make slime. I freaking hate slime. Okay, here is a ballpoint pen, but it is super cute. It's in the shape of an ice cream. I'm looking with my hand and not the camera. I'm looking with, I'm looking with my eyes in real life and not the camera, I apologize. Moving on, this is novelty obviously for a dollar. They have a lot of pencil sharpeners for a dollar. Some look like fish and some are plain Jane, purple, blue, that kind of thing. A ton of erasers, and apparently those are scented. Not sure why you would want that, but I guess for kids, it's fun. Sometimes I forget what it's like to be a kid, you know what I mean? They have this enormous pack of erasers, a six pack, and then they have these mini staplers, anything mini. Oh, look at that orange one and green, black and red. Anything mini just screams, buy me, I'm so cute, you know what I mean? But do I need you? I don't, oh my gosh, even more. Pink and green down here. On the same token, anything jumbo catches my eye too and is like, buy me, I'm so fun and cool. So you can either get an eight pack of normal glue sticks, which I'm not even gonna lie, my kids forget to put the cap back on and I end up having to throw them away <laughs> sometimes because they dry out. Or you can get this cute jumbo stick and risk them drying it out, you know what I mean? But this one, Avery, hey, that's a name brand. Okay, moving on. Sticky notes down here. There's a lot in there, 304 different colors for a dollar. Some scissors right there. Ooh, look at that. Ergo Junior, because they're ergonomic. They are apparently kid tested for fit and comfort, wrist posture and control and accuracy. Cool beans. I also like that they come in a variety of colors as well. If you don't want ergonomic scissors, they even have normal ones, they've got you covered. Even a two pack of the little chintzy ones up there, okay? And the great big ones for us adults. And they have a three notebook hole punch and some rulers. So some rulers have prints on them, different prints. Looks like happy face balloons and hearts. Oh wait, what's in the back? Oh, like lizards, salamanders. I thought they were cats for a second and then floral. That's pretty fun. I can't really reach these to sift through them, but you get the just one ruler and then you can get a two pack if you want. They also have tape here. Yes, tape and a hole punch and a compass. Oh my gosh, calculators. They have a scientific calculator? I don't see one. <laughs> Not for a dollar. Okay, they have sticky notes and what is that? Oh, a magnetic 
folder. You know what? We saw something similar at Target for, I want to say, three bucks with the big magnetic strip on the back. Moving on, they have um, like a book bin organizer. I like to put all kinds of workbooks in there. Hence, work bin organ. Okay, moving on. They also have this, um, an activity tray, which I think is pretty useful. And I bought some, some from Target for $3. And I have used them, and I love it. Uh, they were a tad bigger, you know what I mean? So if you're looking for something a little bigger, same with these. They were bigger at Target for $3. I'm only comparing because I just went there a few days ago. And just so you guys know what else is out there, you know? So they have these organizers as well. Double drawer, little mini organizers. And ooh, wait. Okay, two things I see out of the corner of my eyes. Did I pass the Crayola crayons? Crayola, Crayola racks. They also have Whiteout. I can't remember the last time I bought Whiteout. If I make a mistake, I just redo it or reprint it, you know what I mean? But if you need some, it's name brand. Pick. Heyo. I missed these name brand post-it notes over here. You get a two pack for like two different colors. Or of course a dollar. I don't know why I keep mentioning that. We're at the Dollar Tree. Oh look, purple. Oh, fun. Over here, I see index cards. They're three by five. 200 for a dollar. I don't know if that's a deal. I think elsewhere you can find index card packs for 50 cents, but I can't remember if it's a hundred pack or not. It probably is. And then you get a hundred, ooh, multicolored. Here is something exciting. They have orange and green, but it's an index card with little divider tabs. That's pretty cool. All these pencil cases are really adorable. What? Okay, those are great because they're sturdy, but these are so stinking cute. So they're obviously not sturdy, they're fabric. I don't know what kind of fabric, it feels like, I don't even know, I don't wanna guess. Mm, it doesn't say, or I just can't find it. But this one with the fox, be clever. And they have this one, be kind. Oh, it's just so sweet. I wonder if they have notebooks with those on them. They have a camo right there. A couple different color camos actually. And they have this little notepad, it comes with a pen, and they have it in pink and tan. And down here, these are a screaming deal. Because, <laughs> I know because I bought some from Target last year on clearance for like three bucks. It was ridiculous. So they have a, ooh, a different color option. So red on top, I think they're all clear. Nope, they're not all clear on the bottom. Oh yeah, they are all clear on the bottom, okay. And then they have printed ones with love, little things my stuff oh here's the purple one sparkle i just love those and honestly i don't think you can beat the price great for organizing anything they also have a stream of desk supplies right there so thumbtacks and binder clips rubber bands paper clips down here sorry again i'm looking with my eyes not my camera it's a little dark we have made it to this section again should i sing the song again okay i won't so up here, they have some tab dividers. It looks like five tab dividers. How many are over here? Oh, or eight, depending on your need. And they have an array of binders. So these are hard binders, and these are like the soft, flimsy binders, but pretty cool prints right there. Like the polka dots. They've got some pugs right there, or I shouldn't say pug. I don't know what kind of dog that is. Oh, all kinds of animals, including unicorns. <laughs> Oh, they have camo over here. These are the hard ones. Oh my goodness, look how pretty that is. I still can't believe some of the stuff they sell just for a dollar. Obviously the quality might be a little less, but if you treat your things nicely, you know, you'll have nice things. That's all I'm saying. I tell my kids that all the time. And they also have these solid colors down here, some pastels, some more rich, and then these are the flimsy ones. I say flimsy, but I think you guys understand what I mean. Oh, look at this, this little heart print. Oh, that is adorable. I'm just noticing this for the first time and loving it. You get almost 200 of these little like post-it sticky notes, but you can put them straight into your binder. I adore that. They also have a plethora of folders. These are like kind of a weird material. They're not paper folders. Oh, look how cute that is. A pocket folder. These were my fave. Love that. I just thought about this. If you do re-gift this, 
as like a gift box, it's going to read lunchbox notes. So I don't know, maybe scratch it out or cover it up or something. <laughs> or don't, you know, I, I don't think I would, to be quite honest. I see some portfolio folders over here. And this one, the front is clear, so you can put your cover page like right up front, I guess. And then some character folders. I pulled out, oh, it's a two pack. I didn't realize, oh, wow. That is fun, so I guess you get, wait, is that Fancy Nancy? I guess I don't know what the second one looks like. Oh, maybe, maybe they're exactly the same. I don't know, you also get Spirit. Oh, so fun, I'm riding free. Also, Mickey Mouse. Do you really get two Mickey Mouse? Or is the second one look like this? I guess you'll have to find out. And then a dinosaur, scary. I also have this little pug portfolio down there as well. But what I'm interested in showing you right now are these pouches, these pencil pouches or whatever you wanna use them for. <laughs> Wait, is that a dinosaur or a sea creature? They also have the solar system and then what looks like floral back here. There it is. These can also be put in your binder as well. Dogs, cats, which are my favorite. Glittery ones, all, all kinds of glitter. Blue, silver, pink, purple. Ooh, these are like more of a plastic. Oh, I guess probably because they're glitter, that would make sense. <laughs> and then these pencil pouches. I like that they're clear. Love those. They're obviously a little more durable than the ones that we saw um, like in the very beginning of this video. And then these kind of look like five star uh-oh what did i run into <laughs> uh yeah they kind of remind me of the five star pencil pouches it's a double zip so you get two little pa pockets in it like what and then all kinds of colors all right i skipped a bunch of spiral notebooks but you get the gist if you've seen one you've seen them all oh but that kitty and doggy haven't seen those yet <laughs> oh my gosh for real look at those eyeballs and then you get an assortment of composition notebooks to sift through if you need one. They have a couple cool different prints right there. There's like a tribal print down there. Oh, and then this like gemstone. They also sell construction paper. And I came to the Dollar Tree to look for construction paper the other day. I couldn't find it. Maybe they don't always carry it, but I thought they did. You get 36 pages for a dollar. And then down here, listen, I looked everywhere for this kind of paper when my daughter needed it in kindergarten and I couldn't find it anywhere. Not even Amazon, Michaels, like I dropped around, you know what I mean? People were like, oh, just go to the Dollar Tree. I couldn't even find it here. I don't know if they were sold out or whatever. It was like mid-year, so I'm gonna get a few of these. I still have a few from when I found them last year back to school, but in case you're looking, they have them here for a dollar. I found a bunch of lanyards over here. So I know when I was in school, I used to be mandatory to wear an ID tag. So I don't know if that's still a thing, but if it is, like look how cute these lanyards are. You know what I mean? Personalize it a little bit. And I don't know if these are a deal. Oh look, 10 divider tabs. But you get um, 16 sheet protectors for a dollar. I don't know about that. Also some paper, wide ruled and college ruled. Stock up, now's the time. Lucky what I found. I know some schools require parents to bring in like tissues and paper towels and stuff. Look at this, they have puffs and Kleenex here at the DT for a dollar. Everyone's favorite, lunch supplies. I actually really enjoy shopping for lunch containers. Oh my gosh, they have tuna. Lemon pepper, normal, and then spicy Thai chili. Oh my. And it's name brand. Okay, back to the containers. <laughs> they have these. Well, do I open it? So this is what the spout looks like. Um, how many ounces is this? If I had to guess, I'd say 12. It's pretty skinny, uh, but it is tall. Of course, they have a variety of colors. And then down here, love these containers. Love that they come in a three pack, though I have seen sometimes, correct me if I'm wrong, that they come in a three pack. Did I just say they come They come in a two pack, but sometimes they come. You guys get what I'm trying to say. Oh, right there, see? I wasn't making things up. Okay, so sometimes they come in a three pack. Obviously, make it worth your while and buy a three pack. <laughs> 
uh, these sandwich containers as well. Great price. They're very similar to the Sistema brand. I mean, I don't know about quality because I don't have any, but they look very similar. Down here, it looks like they have some soup mugs or really anything that you want to keep hot. And then larger sandwich containers, though I think you can fit like a salad in there. It's huge. And here is a closed container with two compartments there. And it comes with a fork and a knife. Pretty snaz. Oh, here are all of the different colors. And then these over here, I know some people love them. And correct me if I'm wrong, again, I think these come in a multi-pack as well. Uh, good for dressings and stuff. The Dollar Tree always surprises me with the variety of like snacks and foods that they have. Um, of course, a lot of it is like junky food, but oh my gosh, Oreos, yes. I have found, look, these little orange fruit cups right there. You, ooh, three fruit cups on the go for three do for a dollar. They have peach cups and then mixed fruit. What else did I see? Oh, I saw some raisins. Well, that's pretty much it. And then this Nutella. <laughs> Breadsticks or pretzel sticks, one of each, please. They've got some fruit roll-ups and fruits. And I don't like Curious George. Anyone else? He doesn't talk, okay? I don't like it. I don't know how at this point the Dollar Tree still surprises me, but they carry Glad storage bags, 12 of them. Wow. And then zooming down here, they sell these like antibacterial cleaning wipes. That's good. I don't know if that's mandatory to bring in. And again, the Kleenex. I'm like so surprised that they have these here. Just to browse over here, they also have a plethora of new or restocked uh, storage items. And yes, for $1, here are some more calendars. And then these are the bigger student planners, or they call it a monthly planner here. The other ones we saw were like, you know, this size. Ooh, I actually like this one. It's nice and um, it has a hard cover. I like that. This one's flimsy, but different prints. Oh my gosh, DT, you really have to like, comb through this store to find everything that they have and then they have a ton of 2020 calendars a little early but if you want to prepare take a peek at all of these notebooks they are just uh, lined pages on the inside if I could open it up my goodness gracious okay but I love the covers and what they say right adorable moving down the aisle oh my gosh i don't know how i'm gonna leave without buying this but i don't need it again lined pages inside but it says choose joy ah i love these spiral notebooks they're so stinking cute there's arrows back there a little moose head just so cute like the prints are adorable you know what i think i have to buy it right right <laughs> That's how Dollar Tree gets you in trouble. You're like, oh, it's only a dollar. And then like 50 items later, you're like, wait, hold on. <laughs> this is their sticker section. Nothing we haven't seen before. Stickers, all great, wonderful, hoorah. But guess what I found? Wait, 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 where'd it go? Trolls, yes, very cool. But Toy Story 4. These are so fancy. Jumbo paper clips. They have some really fun erasers there. Let's see if we can peek on anything we haven't seen previously. Oh, you know what I saw? Oh, I know this has nothing to do with back to school, but look at this end cap I just found. A bunch of lip balms down here. Oh my word. But these just look so classy, like the packaging. I don't know what it is. I'm drawn to the muted colors. I've been shopping around trying to find like masks as back to school gifts. And I found this little end cap of really cute looking like lotions and things. Oh my gosh, they even have a facial serum. Are you kidding me? Okay, but what got me are these glitter bath bombs. I don't know how much glitter is in there, but I don't wanna clean it up. <laughs> this is in the back of the store as well. I love these little pencil pouches, or you could use them for anything really, but they also have, oh, like a crayon. Your box breaks, you just, you know, organize it in there. That's pretty cool. And then they have these student planners again. And then I see some more portfolios and just plain colors and notebooks. My phone filled up, so I decided to just take the last few items I wanted to show you and take photographs. Here is a file cabinet 
not a file cabinet. It's for flashcards. It holds them really well. It's perfect size. And then I did find a few like really cute printed folders that were in just the regular stationary section. And here's an array of workbooks, mostly ranging from pre-K to second grade. And I took a picture. This is kind of like the teacher section or if you want to, if you have like a homework station in your house. And then some stickers for you right there. And finally, just a couple of cute bags right there. I thought they were adorable. You can use them for anything. Pencil cases, organized stuff. Oh, and the Dollar Tree has cookie butter. Did you know this? I had no idea. But thank you guys so much for hanging out, shopping with me, and exploring the Dollar Tree and all of their back-to-school supply glory. I hope you enjoyed your time with me. If you did, make sure to subscribe, put a little more happy in your day, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.